YouTube content creators will get a laugh out of my story about how YouTube's AI hates my guts. Laugh and learn about our passion for video. I was inspired by Virginia Kerr's video, Why Posting Bad Videos Will Blow Up Your Small YouTube Channel. It is the time to start posting bad videos so you can blow up your small channel. So I posted, I made a bad video to blow up my channel. Oh, there are millions of us small YouTubers watching videos about growing channels. Oh, like VidIQ's 2 million subscribers. Oh, Virginia's video had 40,000 views. Oh, veteran YouTube coach Nolan Molt has a similar video, as does Pod Sound School with 94,000 subscribers. So YouTube should be able to find some content creators that watch similar videos that might be interested in mine. But check out the AI's target audience for me. Sister seduces brother-in-law. What happens next will shock you. Sheesh. Is that what the AI thinks of my channel? Ah, uh, the best one is, God wants you to see this. Now that makes sense. My video has an anti-war message. What? View time is one second. I guess that means God doesn't want you to see my video. Or my channel hasn't got a prayer. And what did I do in the first second that got me canceled? I'm Uncle Blurf. Oh, I identified as a dinosaur. <laughs> Obviously not a creationist. Ah, good thing the Christians nuked me before they got to my topless Armageddon scene. Then there's this video, 9 Sep 2024. A brief video showing a girl sneeze while applying makeup. <laughs> Oof, that's all. That's all I'm doing today. Is YouTube saying this is a bad video? And those viewers might also like my video that promises to be bad? Hell no! She has 100,000 subs. I won't criticize her, but as my channel is mostly political satire, I don't know why YouTube would target an audience that's about a quarter of my age. It's hard to trust YouTube's analytics. I actually lost a subscriber with this video. Strange, since none of my subscribers watched it. No, I didn't tick the box to notify subscribers. So here's another way I get cyber screwed. How viewers found this video. Suggested videos, 47%. Browse features, 21%. So with 68%, 13 of my 19 views are from impressions. But the system is only crediting me for five, of giving me an abysmal click-through rate. The AI started hating me once I posted the video, AI is fake news. Sweet revenge. Well, that was my worst performing video on YouTube at the time. Well, if you could believe their numbers. The typical retention graph shows a bunch of people dropping off early, then a slow decline as most people settle in to watch to the end. But here's AI is fake news. Looks like a hospital heart monitor. Or my viewers are all robots that hit fast forward in exact unison. Ah, uh, this chart has to be bogus. More recently, I broke my record low on YouTube with the video, Yes, you too can be an evil supervillain with seven views. It has 200 views on BitChute, so creators should consider also posting on other platforms with nicer robots. Another analytic tip, be careful about your titles affecting YouTube search. Talking about insane sea level predictions, instead of saying fear mongering, I said fear porn in my title, lies, fear porn, and disgusting hypocrisy of the rich. I went three viewers searched on YouTube for porn. Of the AI directed them to my video. And their view durations were 1 second, 4 seconds, and 14 seconds before they clicked off. Can you not last at least 6 minutes? And now that I've talked about porn in the top of the scene in this video, oh, the AI is going to send more creeps to this video. Good thing I didn't discuss my Jeffrey Epstein video. Oops. Another danger for creators is friends. Here I had two Facebook friends clicking my bad video link. But they only stayed for eight seconds, which really hurt. Even my viewer from the makeup show lasted 10 seconds. Gee, I promised a bad video. Either don't click it or watch long enough to detect my sarcasm. Uh, the takeaway is expressed by Ali Abdal. Your friends don't care that you do YouTube. And that ties in with Virginia Kerr's challenge. Don't be afraid to make a bad video because most of your friends aren't watching anyway. Loosen up some inhibitions to unlock some creativity. 
I never had so much fun making a video. Tried some new music and sound effects, put in funny cameo appearances, played a few audio clips backwards, and made controversial political statements to trigger people into clicking dislike and leaving nasty comments, even telling them, don't just go away quietly. Remember, silence is violence. Even negative comments would feed the mighty AI. Of course, nobody saw any of this, because they didn't get past the first minute. Breaking news. The AI is screwing with my head again. I was nearly finished this video when my bad video was flatlined in 19 views. Then YouTube dumped out 9,000 recommendations over three hours and the views started piling in, stopping at 470. But they were sent to the same random crowd. So 90% of those 470 that clicked on, clicked off in under a minute. Of the few remaining, I got 27 likes and two dislikes. Many of the comments expressed surprise at how my video could possibly get recommended in their feed, as none of them had admitted to being content creators. Shout out to McChilly Daly, who wrote, So bad it was good. I felt like the guy in Clockwork Orange after he takes the acid and his eyes are forced open to watch the movie. I cannot in good conscience downvote this. I even subbed. I'm cured! Praise God! Ah, thanks. That really warms my heart. I hear some weird analytics. 452 views from recommendations, but only 313 views from impressions credited towards my click-through rate. Audience, 100% male. 100%! 11,000 impressions, and not one to female? Uh, nobody was under 25 or over 65. So who's the creepy guy watching the makeup video? So my bad video hasn't blown up the channel yet, since the AI recommended it to people unlikely to watch even halfway. So I'll cut the first half out and upload the second half out without explaining the context. Now that'll be a bad video, but great fun. But before I cut it, I dare you to click this end screen so you can see the full length bad video, my director's cut and insult me in the comments to make the AI happy.